Hi everyone. So today I want to talk about what is the biggest number. So of course, what do you think? What is the biggest number you can think of? So I think a lot of people are going to suggest infinity. Of course, I talked about infinity before. Make sure you check out that or those videos. And infinity, of course, is not a number. It's just a concept that something goes on forever without end. So infinity is not a number. So therefore, it's not the biggest number. And then, of course, some people is going to say infinity minus one. And of course, like I said in my previous videos, infinity minus one equals infinity. So infinity minus one is not the biggest number. And in fact, there's actually no biggest number because there's a, I mean, there are an infinite number of numbers. You can always add one to any number and make it bigger. And there's no end to it. And therefore, there's no biggest number. However, there is at least, you know, is a largest named number. So in this video, we're gonna talk about what are some of the largest named number. And of course, in this video, I'm just gonna give you a brief summary. I'm not gonna tell you how big they are. They are just, you know, I cannot even tell you how big they are. They are just very, very big. big. I mean, way bigger than three, three, or anything like that. Or way bigger than chi of 3-3 three, three. so anyway let's talk about that right now so first of course we have rayo's number which is uh i mean quite famous and generally generally accepted as the largest named number for a very long time and of course you can look it up yourself or watch uh, some of my videos or other videos online to see what it actually is i'm not gonna explain it right now and second of course we have the big food um, it was also considered to be the biggest named number for some time. However, later it's found out to be ill-defined, which means it's not very well defined. It's kind of vague. And it's actually found out to be a naive extension of Rayo's number. And next we have this oblivion and utter oblivion. And again, they are later considered to be ill-defined. Again, I'm not going to say what it is and how big they are. You can kind of look it up yourself. Those numbers, all the numbers here are kind of, you know, hard to explain using, you know, daily mathematics. So make sure you check them out yourself. Next, you have the fish number seven, which is based on an extension of Rayo's number. So it's kind of not generally accepted as the biggest name number. You know, if it's a U defined or naive extension generally is not quite accepted and next you have this little bigotin it was once recognized to be the largest named number before it's considered to be ill-defined so again most of these numbers here are ill-defined later to, uh, to be found to be ill-defined and then next you have this Sasquatch um, and this one is actually too difficult for anyone to understand what it actually is so again that is why it's not generally except as the biggest named number and then right now the current biggest named number according to Googleology at least as of right now in this video 2020 April is called the garden's number so the reason is the currently the biggest name number is because it hasn't yet been proven that it is ill-defined so who knows maybe later <laughs> again it was found to be ill-defined then it can be dethroned so this is your answer garden's number is currently the biggest number you can look it up yourself again i cannot tell you how big it actually is and again, the only reason it is the largest name number right now because it hasn't been proven otherwise. And of course, I'm gonna quickly talk about the salad number. Salad number is actually any number made up of uh, a mix of existing numbers or functions, usually made up or created by inexperienced uh, people, I would say. So one example would be Graham's number factorial. Of course, um, 
I mean, this kind of number appears a lot in the comment section. People trying to make a bigger number, and they try to put two famous big numbers or functions together and try to make a much bigger number, and they think that is the biggest number or you know, much bigger than the original number. And of course, we know that uh, G sixty four factorial is actually much smaller than G sixty five. Another good example would be the Ackermann. So Ackermann here stands for the Ackermann function. Here it is Ackermann G64, G64, you know, most people think it's very, very big. You know, the Ackermann function is a very fast growing function and you put G64 in it. And they think it's a very big number, but actually, again, this is actually smaller than G65. And lastly, let's talk about Sam's number. A lot of people ask me to talk about it. Uh, this is the only definition, or you can again look it up. This is the brief summary. It is just so huge that it cannot be described. So again, this is actually like an inside joke of Googleology, you know, because this is, of course, is not very well defined. It's badly defined, actually. This is basically its description. It's just so huge that it cannot be described. So it's kind of like a joke number. So there we have it. This is kind of a quick list of the biggest number uh, that is maybe bigger than Rayo's number. Of course, a lot of people still believe Rayo's number is the biggest number, uh, biggest named number because it's not actually ill-defined. And a lot of numbers here are actually, in some sense, is kind of based on the Rayo's number. So I think Rayo's number still has its fame uh, you know, you can still say it's the biggest number, biggest name number, but it's up to you. And again, any people can make up a biggest name number, but of course you cannot use naive extension. You cannot just say Rayo's number plus one. So anyway, thanks for watching and have a nice day.